Dr. Squatch Men's All Natural Deodorants Review. Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I wanna to do a little review on these deodorants that I saw on Amazon by the brand of Dr. Squatch. Now I'm pretty sure almost everybody who's a guy and has been on YouTube has seen those commercials of that one guy with the soaps talking about like all the natural soaps, how everyone buys the cheap crappy soaps and his soaps are the best soaps and they smell so good. I'll put that guy on, on screen, but it's basically the Dr. Squatch brand and they kind of moved over into deodorants. It makes sense because they're probably killing it with soap so I was just popping around on Amazon I kind of didn't know where to start because I didn't like all the cheap axes I wanted something that's not only aluminum free but it's natural as you could get and that's what's something that these guys really really push they do things pretty much as natural as you could get but they almost have like the presentation of like an old spice they're pretty good for odor blocking like I haven't really found like one deodorant is like way more odor blocking than the rest I found that most deodorants I've used in my life are pretty good for odor blocking and this one is no different. I feel like it lasts a long time too. I mean, probably in the range of 12 to 16 hours. I know that I put this on like sometime in the middle of the day and I could smell it when I woke up the next day. I was like, wow, it's like a long time because I didn't put this on like at bed. I put this on yesterday and I woke up and I smelled it. And then sometimes you could smell a little bit sometimes after a shower. So it definitely does last a long time. And as far as the actual smells go, they make it seem like these fragrances are just like some of the best fragrances ever or like the smells of these are just the best smells you could ever get. They were a little bit overhyped in my opinion. They don't smell bad, but it's not like they smell like a good cologne or something. They're just decent, you know? The Alpine Sage almost smells a little bit kind of like minty, just like a minty, fresh, generic good though, you know? And then the Bay Rum almost smells like a little cinnamony. It almost smelled a little bit old man cinnamony, just a slight little bit, but from the times that I ever used it, I just mainly smell that cinnamon vibe. I really do enjoy these. The only thing I really would say that I don't like about them so far is that it's like $30 for two. I feel like $10 is like a perfect good price for these because I really, really enjoy these. I kind of want to make these my go-to for basically all my deodorant, but at the same time, it's like, you know, I don't know, I might try a few other brands. However, this kind of has everything in one and a lot of those natural deodorants, the presentation is just kind of, ugh, and then they almost don't have any fragrance. I do like that these fragrances are at least, you know, somewhat enjoyable. It's not like a medicinal kind of smell or just like an off-putting kind of smell. I do enjoy the fragrance here. So anyways, guys, I do highly recommend these i just wish that they were a little bit cheaper i think ten dollars would be good i found i think two for 30 and if i try them again i will be trying some of the other fragrances out but anyways guys let me know what you think of dr squatch do you use any random deodorant do you have a special deodorant that you use i'll be very interested to see down below i don't think i've done a deodorant review on this channel yet so here we are today anyways guys we're on the road to 50,000 subscribers and i couldn't do it without any of you guys help you guys are the best i'm having a great day out here hopefully i'm having a great day at home. See you all in the next video. Peace.